I just kind of suffered through it not knowing what it was. I knew I had a lot more worry than other people, but I just felt like it was my fault, but I wasn't sure why I felt like it was my fault. Um, my mom and I had been watching an Oprah Winfrey episode, and my mom realized that what Oprah was talking about was also something that she had, which was um, body dysmorphic disorder. When she finally found a therapist that specialized in OCD, she contacted the therapist and began having sessions with her, and her recovery was incredible. It was like the mother I remember seeing when I was really, really little and hadn't seen in a very long time. So I began my journey with therapy, and um, while I'm sitting across from my therapist in her office and I'm talking to her about my symptoms that my OCD wants me to be ashamed and wants me to hide those symptoms and hide those thoughts. I was so lucky that my first therapist that I ever saw specialized in what exactly I needed. Um, that gave me hope to, to get better and it also gave me hope that it wasn't my fault. Throughout my life I've always struggled with my OCD. Um, sometimes I struggled a lot and sometimes I just struggled a little and I've come to accept that that's just what it is for me. Um, sometimes OCD can be really loud in my head and sometimes it can be really quiet. The most important thing for me is realizing that I have OCD and OCD doesn't have me.